Hey, hey, hey! In today's video, I'm gonna be changing your life. Well, not really. I'm just gonna be showing you guys how to make a protein dessert that actually doesn't taste like shit. And I know what you are thinking. You've been trying these desserts. You've been trying these recipes, and it it never really turns out right, right? Because you are trying it on your diet and you are like, I just want to eat something good, something nice and you make it and you are like, yeah, yeah, it's pretty good but then you, yeah, then you never touch that recipe ever again in your life. I know the feeling. But this is not going to be one of them and I'm not going to be lying to you guys. It was not made just by me, it was inspired by Remington James and I really, really recommend to you guys to check out his channel, blah, 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 da, da, da. But anyways, it's absolutely just amazing recipe, trust me. Also, it is something that anybody can... Anyways, you don't care about all this stuff, you just want to see the recipe, you know? So let's just, nah, just jump, no, oh, go. Let's see. Alright well, guys, so how you are making this recipe is very simple. You simply put everything into one bowl, you mix it up and then you put it into, let's say, a muffin form or just anything else and you just bake it. The muffin form is good, but if you don't want it in any shape, then just put it in anything else and you can just bake it. Same, same thing. Very important thing, you need a food scale. You always need a food scale. I'm not going to explain to you guys why, because I know that you are geniuses and you don't need to know this. So just get a food scale, guys. So first of all, we are putting 30 grams of flour, which I did not include in the ingredient section, because I am a moron and I forgot it. Anyway, 30 grams of flour, followed by 30 grams of PB feet. Use PB feet and not protein powder because this is kind of the secret in this recipe. I'm not sure why, but it just makes it so gooey and nice. Just use it. Trust me, it's gonna be amazing. 15 grams of cacao. Anyways, let's just speed up this video because you also, the ingredients, you just put them in and then you mix it up. So let's speed right now. I didn't even start this fucking video. <laughs> I did. And here comes a little extra secret. If you are still watching this video, then you are the lucky one. Because you're gonna know that if you put some bananas on top, it's gonna make it even more gooey and creamy and it's just gonna be amazing. But of course you have to count with the fact that in this case it's gonna be like a hundred calories more. So just always count with that. But otherwise, just I'm putting one piece of banana onto every single one of them, which is gonna make it even more amazing. Alright guys, so this is how the finished product looks. I just put it into the oven for around... You wanna heat it up for around 200 degrees, though my oven is... <laughs> 